The Old Maid by Sarah Teasdale Read for LibriVox.org by Claudia Salto I saw her in a Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. Her hair was dull and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark, unwarmed forever by love's flame. I felt my lover look at her, and then turned suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy the woman I shall never be. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Old Maid by Sarah Teasdale Read for LibriVox.org by Kalif Storch I saw her in the Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. Her hair was dull and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark, unwarmed forever by love's flame. I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy the woman I shall never be. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. By Sarah Teasdale. Read for LibriVox.org by David Lawrence. I saw her in a Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. Her hair was dull, and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark unwarmed forever by love's flame. I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy the woman I shall never be. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. By Sarah Teasdale Read for LibriVox.org by Diana Meilinger I saw her in a Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. Her hair was dull and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, Hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark, Unwarmed forever by love's flame. I felt my lover look at her, And then turn suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy The woman I shall never be. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Old Maid by Sarah Teasdale. Read for LibriVox.org by Deborah Lee. I saw her in a Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. I felt my lover look at her and then turn suddenly to me. Her hair was dull and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark, unwarmed forever by love's flame. 
I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy the woman I shall never be. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. The Old Maid by Sarah Teasdale, read for LibriVox.org, by Jenny Meisberger, Gig Harbor, Washington. I saw her in a Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. Her hair was dull and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark, unwarmed forever by love's flame. I felt my lover look at her and then turn suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy the woman I shall never be. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. By Sarah T. Stade, read for LibriVox.org by Julia Niedermeyer. I saw her in a Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. I felt my lover look at her, and then turned suddenly to me. Her hair was dull and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark, unwarmed forever by love's flame. I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy the woman I shall never be. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. By Sarah Teasdale, read for LibriVox.org, by Leanne Howlett. I saw her in a Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. I felt my lover look at her and then turn suddenly to me. Her hair was dull and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark, unwarmed forever by love's flame. I felt my lover look at her and then turn suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy the woman I shall never be. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain. Made by Sarah Teasdale, read for LibriVox.org by Leonard Wilson of Springfield, Ohio. I saw her in a Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. I felt my lover look at her and then turn suddenly to me. Her hair was dull and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark, unwarmed forever by love's flame. I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy the woman I shall never be. And a poem. This recording is in the public domain. Made by Sarah Teasdale. Read for LibriVox.org by Pam Castile. I saw her in a Broadway car, the woman I might grow to be. 
I felt my lover look at her, and then turn suddenly to me. Her hair was dull and drew no light, and yet its color was as mine. Her eyes were strangely like my eyes, though love had never made them shine. Her body was a thing grown thin, hungry for love that never came. Her soul was frozen in the dark, unwarmed forever by love's flame. I felt my lover look at her, and then turned suddenly to me. His eyes were magic to defy the woman I shall never be. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.